My life had hit a rough patch. A 10-year rough patch. Sure, it was 10 years without daily beatings from my father, but it was also 10 years with no job, no cash, no hope, and certainly no warm embraces from my mom and our one big boot. <laughs> Desperate, I started panhandling, and one day I was in a particularly rich neighborhood when I saw a house that struck my fancy. You, boy on the street, who lives here? Oh, well, that's Mr. Tesla's house. Nicola Tesla? Yeah. <laughs> We're about to have dinner. I guess there's room for one more. Cool, I hope you're having spaghetti. <laughs> I'd be lying if I said my intention wasn't to kill Nicola and take all of his money, but then I saw something that changed my mind. Edson, I'd like you to meet my wife, Elizabeth. <laughs> I wanted in there. Man. <laughs> oh, please meet you, Elizabeth. You have such a beautiful home. I'm like, thank you so much. I try my best to keep it up, but there are only so many hours in the day, you know. That is true. Nico, <laughs> hey, would you mind getting some extra silverware? Oh, silverware? No. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, what's wrong? It's just. Ten years ago, I was bitten in the ass by a werewolf. <laughs> I don't understand if you want me to leave. No, no. Oh my god, please sit back down. I'm so sorry to hear that. Thank you. Edison, I doubt you were attacked by a werewolf. Uh, perhaps a number of things. Uh, a large dog? Watch your mouth. Nixa. <laughs> were you raised in an extremely rude bar? If a man says he was a bit about a werewolf, then he was a bit about a werewolf. I'm I am so please, sorry. Please. I have to deal with a lot of prejudice being a werewolf, so this is just another drop in the bucket. I understand. As I'm trying not to be rude, I'm just saying, saying you're a werewolf is a classic case of phony baloney. Again, watch your mouth. <laughs> Mr. Anderson, do you ever have dreams that you're a wolf? Yes. Every night I'm a, I dream that I'm a wolf and... Well, there's no appropriate way to say this. I'm a wolf and I'm porking another wolf. <laughs> Oh, cool. Thank you. Good night, Mr. Edison. 
It was a pleasure. <laughs> Elizabeth, wake up! Hello? Hey! Uh, what's going on? Who is it? It's Thomas Edison, that handsome woman, war, werewolf from dinner. <laughs> Well, what do you want? I'm tired. Look, you're really starting to piss me off. Can you just come out here? It's going to take like 30 seconds. Oh, there you are. Oh. Mr. Anderson, why is it so important that you drag me out in the middle of the night for? I can't sleep. I can't sleep because I can't stop thinking about you, and I can't stop thinking about you because I love you. Mr. Anderson. I know you like those silly inventions that Tesla makes, so I made one of my own. It's an electric necklace. I don't think this is appropriate. You're really trying my patience right now, okay? <laughs> Look, just try it on, and if you don't feel the same way that I feel, then I'll leave. I'll get my things, and I'll leave. Okay, fine. I'll try it on. Oh, my. Oh, it is more beautiful than I thought it would be. It's not beautiful at all. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. I'm going to plug it in so that I can see you in the light. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no! Elizabeth, is something burning? I'm coming out. Hey, what's going on? Oh my god, is that Elizabeth? Oh, Jesus! Whoa, whoa, whoa! She has no pulse. She's dead. Yeah, you killed her, man. What? Yeah. My Elizabeth! Yep. Wait. It looks like she's wearing some sort of shitty necklace. Hey, leave the necklace out, alright? You should be so lucky to get a necklace like that, okay? <laughs> what happened? I don't know, because I, I was in bed, but I heard someone say like, It's me, Elizabeth, Nikola Tesla's wife, and he's coming at me, and he's sleepwalking, and he's gonna kill me. Well, I don't, other than that. <laughs> I, I don't remember any of this. Because you were sleepwalking, man. <laughs> Elizabeth probably didn't want to wake you up, because... If you wake up somebody who's sleepwalking, that's a death sentence. <laughs> I'm just gonna turn myself in. I'm gonna call the cops. Whoa, 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 whoa. no cops. <laughs> Tommy boy doesn't do, do cops, all right? Uh, they call it the slammer for a reason. It's because they slam their fists together like that after they make love to your anus. <laughs> Let's just go on the run, man. I like you, I'll come with, you know? She's a good wife, man. She loved you a lot, but uh... We're gonna need to get like a blunt object, something like a ball peen hammer and knock out her teeth <laughs> so that they can't identify her. <laughs> well, I'm pretty sure I saw a hacksaw over there. You're gonna need to get that and cut off her fingertips because those are coming with us too. Just <laughs> do it. I'll be in the car. <laughs>
pop up. Yeah. So, uh, what's your name? My name? Yeah. <coughs> Cody. <laughs> Just Cody? What, what's your last name? Cody. <laughs> your name is Cody Cody? <laughs> yes, I'm afraid so. <laughs> So, uh, you live up here all by yourself, Cody? Cody? Yes, all alone, left to my own devices. <laughs> I do have the occasional visitor, but it's never long before they seem to disappear. <laughs> you want big house? Yeah, you got a nice house there, Cody Cody? Uh, yes, I do. One might say it's to die for. <laughs> What do you do to pass the time up here all by yourself? I dig holes. <laughs> I also collect beanie babies. <laughs> you like to go in and see my collection? You know, Cody Cody, I wouldn't thank you for the uh, beanie baby kind of guy. Well, then you'd be dead wrong. <laughs> Sorry. Because I have the world's largest collection of beanie babies. Okay. I even have the teeny beanies. <laughs> Here we are, 666, Heels Above Boulevard. <laughs> <laughs> okay, man, I think we're just going to let you off. Uh, have a good night. Leaving so soon? Yeah, you know, Edison and I were just going to uh, keep on keeping on. Yeah, you know, that's right. But I've got beanies. <laughs> okay, look, we're just going to go in there. You can rest your eyes. To turn down such an offer would be a... Grave mistake. Yeah, we're thinking about it. That is sharp. All right, look, we're just gonna go in there. We're gonna check out these Beanie Babies. Maybe get some food, a little rest guy, and we'll hit the road in the morning. Okay. We're in. Right this way. I love the bees. <laughs> well, I've got something even better for you down in my cellar. <laughs> I don't know, man. Look, have you seen those bees? Okay. We're, We're in. in. Come with me. <laughs> that smell just hit you. Oh my god. It's like the oldest room I have ever yes, been. Yes, it's a very old house. Yeah. Oh my god, was that a rat? Yes, we have rats. It's an old house. And he has a name. What's his name? What? Kratis <laughs> It is just disgusting. Don't. Yeah. Don't. Don't do it. Okay. You know what? Is, it's very I've had enough to hear with you. You guys weren't even that excited about my penis. So I'm getting so angry. I'm, just I'm getting you. angry like I feel like getting violence. That's how angry. I'm just telling like, like, if you sweat, once a month. Oh, okay. I'm at the boiling point right now. Especially with you. You're making being, me the most angry. Uh, yeah. Just wait till we get down in the cellar. Because I'm very angry. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. What did you want to show us anyway? Oh, it's right over here. Surprise! What is even going on right now? You felt bad about your wife dying, man, so we threw you a party. <laughs> Montana, that's Jaqueen, and I think that's just a guy. <laughs> this is gonna be the best night of my life! Hey, hey yo, DJ, DJ, spin that Cody, thank you 
thanks so much. That was the best party I've ever been to. It was, it was a bumper. What do you mean? Come on, man. That wild ass party you threw for me last night. Party? Yes. There hasn't been a party here in 30 years. Oh! Let's get out of here! <laughs> Yeah, when I think back on it, there was definitely something super weird about that Cody Cody. <laughs> yeah. Like who, what are Beanie Babies? I don't even know what those Why are. Why did you pick the heads off them? <laughs> He's a weird dude. Yeah. What are you drawing over there? Some kind of perverted picture, you old horn dog? <laughs> oh, this? It's just my idea book. Your Pidea book? What's that? No, my idea book. A Pidea book? What's that? No, my idea book. Well, you should have said that the first time. <laughs> <laughs> just my idea where I write all my ideas for inventions. Well, what are you working on now? I don't know. It's still a rough idea. I just thought it'd be cool if I got a big orange cat to love Italian cuisine. <laughs> and love Mondays. <laughs> no, wait, he should hate Mondays! <laughs> <laughs> I gotta tell you, I don't see how you make any money off of these inventions. Okay, you don't like that one, but you wanna know what I've really been working on? Yes, it's good! Yeah, tell me. I mean, I think it's gonna light up the world. It's gonna brighten people's lives. Just tell me. Okay. It's a basketball team called the Harlem Globetrotters. <laughs> but this isn't your grandmother's basketball team. They're going to combine athletics, comedy, and theater in a way that's never been done before. It's really dumb. Well, I think people are going to like it. No. What else are you working on? Well, I have this idea for the light bulb, but I don't think that's going anywhere. I like you, man, but... You got like an alien brain. No, you don't, dude. Do. Stop. Yeah. Not man, Mars. you're from like Mars. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Can you walk over? I gotta use the rest of Yeah, yeah, yeah sure. <laughs> well, you got pee on your finger? No, <laughs> yeah, shut up. And hey, wash your hands. I do. <laughs> it's a pie book. Pineapple on pizza? <laughs> <laughs> Live strong bracelets? Man, what is this guy smoking? <laughs> What's this light bulb thing? Now this looks like something I can use. Looks like Tommy Edison is about to make a trip to the patent office. <laughs> to patent all the ideas I'm about to steal. <laughs> <laughs> See you, sucker! <laughs> That's the way I sat on one of my balls!